Master Fanny with a special message for Robert Clevin Like Eleven. It's a weird nickname. Uh, says your birthday, you're turning 51 years old to celebrate. Your parents are driving into town for dinner. You're a real estate broker, and it says here you wanted to become a ninja in Japan, but you never got into proper martial arts training. In fact, you got in trouble as a kid for throwing ninja stars at sheetrock and creating holes that had to be patched. Uh, it's actually good that that happened because that deterred you from the gateway drug that is ninjutsu, because ninjutsu is a bunch of bullshit. Um, if you had enjoyed that, who knows what you'd be doing now? You'd be, uh, you know, you would have started by running around at night in your pajamas throwing smoke bombs, and the next thing you know, you're doing Tai Chi. And then you're not only somebody who can't fight, but you look ridiculous. Uh, as far as the throwing, I don't know if you know this, you can throw just about anything and turn it into a weapon. Um, it just depends, like, the methods differ. Like, if you're throwing a playing card, you have to throw it uh, at the right angle so that it floats on the air and then uh, hits a vital target and slices. Um, that requires precision. Or you can just throw a brick. A brick, it don't really matter. You just throw a brick in the general direction of somebody you don't like and it's going to do its job. Uh, but you have to have the strength. you got to work the brick throwing muscles in order to do that. Uh, That's actually one of the things I like about the nunchaku is that it is a throwing weapon. A lot of people don't use it that way. Uh, you can throw it two ways. One is you can hang on to one end of it and throw it out like that. Okay? Or you can just throw the whole thing. Uh, usually someone comes at you and you brandish the nunchaku. They start to run away and then you can aim for their feet, throw it, and then that tangles in their feet. They fall down and then you do what you want. So just a couple of ideas. I would just practice throwing things around the house on your birthday. Um, maybe a cake. Somebody brings your birthday cake, chuck it at them, see what they do. Anyway, I'm Master Ken. Happy 51st birthday. Uh, remember, always restock that groin. Herp.